Yeah, bro. He's cool, bro. He's a cool guy. Cool guy. Pretty dope. Yeah, maybe we'll vlog again sometime. You know what I'm saying? Wherever you come down. They they actually did invite me to Miami for their meet and greet, but I wasn't able to go. My grandma had a birthday party. I was like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to give you more attraction right there. I know. Word. Can you collab with different people? That's crazy. That's what I'm saying. That would have been dope if I would have if I would have went, but I couldn't go. My grandma had a surprise birthday party. I was like, damn. Birthday party. There's a lot of stuff going on at once, man. Yeah, bro. So like, True. hey, maybe next time, bro. So you be good though. You be good. Um, Back, bro. Ninth question. Um, do you ever question anything about? This existence, hmm, all the in time the way, in, in, in the way we have to live to make it out, such as like constantly grinding, constantly trying gotta make money, constantly gotta work and all this extra shit. Like, yeah, do you yeah. ever like question this existence? Like, what are, like, I, what are your thoughts? Like, it always it has always pissed me off about you know this existence. I it's just oh, yeah, bro. I, I definitely understand what you mean. Yeah, I understand what you mean. Like, I think about this all the time, especially like the older I get. It's like, bro, like I gotta work to live. I gotta work to to eat, to to rent, like to like to j- just to do certain shit. But it's like I'm trying to I'm trying to get I'm trying to have like a better understanding and a better yeah a better understanding too as well. Yeah, what, you, wanna, a, you wanna yeah yeah like a, a better relationship with it too because like if you have a good relationship when it comes to like you know working I guess or doing something that you you know enjoy um, you enjoy. Or just doing shit you gotta do, like then I feel like then the process will go by smoother. But yeah, bro, like I question all the time, like bro, like I gotta make money to feed myself, to drink water, to have shelter. Like it's just is it is a weird, it is a weird, um, a weird system we live in for sure. It is weird because if you think about it, animals and shit, them niggas is chilling, bro. Like they just chilling, bro. Like they don't gotta go to work, they don't gotta pay rent or anything, bro. So like. I think about that all the time, like especially as I get older. Like, yeah, I want to have my own shit. Yeah, I want to. I have things like I have dreams and shit. Like, I really want to fulfill. And I'd be thinking, like, damn, like, okay, how am I gonna get there? Like, like the best possible situation for me, bro. Because, like, like I said, bro, like for me, bro, I, I do not want to be slaving like a job for the rest of my life, bro. Like, there's nothing wrong with working. You know what I'm saying working to get to mm-hmm. the next level. Because, like, bro, my whole thing with jobs is like, bro. Work a job, bro, so that way you can get to the next level. Like, don't just like stay at your job and just be there and mm-hmm. have no goals. Like, nah, bro, use your job to work for something. Like, like yeah. work towards something. You know what I'm saying? Don't just go to work just to go to work. Nah, nigga, work towards something. You know what I'm saying? Start something. Like, you know, create create shit outside of the job. You know, because yeah, you can't rely on these jobs. You know what I'm saying? So, my whole thing is like, bro, I really want to like create systems for me. To where I don't have to rely on the next man to pay my bills, or like I don't gotta rely on my boss to pay me, cause that mm-hmm. nigga he could drop me off anytime. Hey, bro, you're going. The fuck you mean? Friends. And like, bro, my whole thing, bro, I want freedom, and it, and it like it sucks how we gotta work for freedom. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. we gotta work, 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 and it's also like, bro, like if you think about it, like we're we're just like. They want us to the way that they programmed us. They want us to like constantly chase money, chase money, chase money, chase money until we die. Like, yeah, until you drop dead. Man. But it's like at the same time, I don't want to chase money. I want to attract it. Like I want to, I want to have money to where like me and my family were are good. Like I want to yeah. give my family different experiences that they never experienced. I don't want to live the same life that they live in. You know what I'm saying? Like not saying that mm-hmm. their life is trash, but I want to have a different experience. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I got different choices. I got to make different sacrifices. You know what I'm saying? So. Most definitely, bro. Like, just the way that the, the way that this whole fucking e- economy is, this, this system, it, it it definitely is weird. The older I get, and the more I start to learn about it, but like I said, bro, it's all about your um your 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 perspective and how you look at things. You know. Hmm. Um. I feel what you're saying, cause like I be thinking about it too. This is why I say, if you're gonna be working a job, and you should have always have a backup. Not even I'm not gonna say a backup plan, but like a backup of something that you're gonna be doing on the side. And yeah. that is the main and people and it's like it's like this existence in society, they're okay with they're okay with staying in one position. Yeah. Bro. That's not how our life should be. Mm-mm. Why stick to one job when you do multiple things behind the scenes? 
You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I, I understand where you're coming from because they want to stay, stay like it's like a magnet. They want you to like stick to one thing. Like it's like a magnet. It's like yeah, no. stay in the box. <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like no, I don't want that. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I feel you coming from for real. Like it's wild. You know what I'm saying? So like, I don't get it either. I don't ever mm. understand it. Who created this shit? <laughs> I'm saying, like, who created this? Who set this up for us? You know what I'm saying? Who's in control for real? You know what I'm saying? Because eventually, they're not going to need us no more. You can be already creating robots on this other stuff. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like so AI. I question the existence. I was like, what's the point even bringing the kids in the, in the world? If y'all, got, y'all creating robots and all this extra stuff, they're not going to need us no more at one point. At some point, they're not going to need us anymore. Yeah, bro. Eventually, wow. we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna run out of food. They're gonna just copy and paste like they always do. Process foods. It, it, it's gonna it's gonna, yeah. it's gonna it's gonna constantly just be processed food. Robots. I'm telling you, they they're <laughs> not, not gonna need anymore. They're not gonna need us. Cause like I feel like also when, when, especially with the food industry, like especially like let's say us as a society, we're 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 constantly relying on these grocery stores to feed us, but in reality. Bro, we can never really like this. Like, let's say, let's say tomorrow there is a food shortage, bro. There's no such thing as a food shortage, my nigga. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> we, we, we have the ability to grow our own shit. You know what I'm Facts. saying? They, but that, they never taught us that in school. They don't teach us gardening. Yep. yep. Be essential. That should be essential in school. Teach us how to fucking garden, my nigga. So that way, if this shit goes down, okay, I got my garden in the backyard. I'm good. You know what I'm saying? Like, so like, like I was saying, going back to what I was saying with the food shortage, bro. Like. There's really no such thing as food shortage. Just like, bro, we're we live in an, we live in abundance. Mother Nature gives us what we need, but just mm-hmm. like when we rely on the system, that's when shit goes goes weird. And like you said, with AI, bro, that shit is developing. You know what I'm saying? So who knows how that shit's gonna be in the future? All I know is, bro, like, hey, <laughs> nah, for real, yes. that's, this shit's like, I don't know. It, it's cool. Like, don't get me wrong, you can use AI to its advantage, but. My like I, I do think about that sometimes. Like, where is this shit going to develop? Like, whatever happens is 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 ine- inevitable. So like, what like what is going to happen? You never know. Like you know, like they got all these movies where uh, robots develop. Yep. And I don't know, bro. It, it, it's it's gonna be uh, it's gonna be hell for for our generation, man. It's going to be hell for us, man. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. It's not to me pit to pit fear, no, because you know the truth as well. You know, you know, you know the game already. The game mm-hmm. is rigged. You know the game. You know what I'm saying? So it's like that's the truth, right, Dave? What you just said, bro. Yeah, bro. All we gotta do is at least try to like make it out. This, this, this existence we live in. You know what I'm saying? And um, you just keep up. Try, try to keep a positive mindset. Cause a lot of people tell us to be positive, be positive, and yeah, a whole lot of stuff going on at once. Too many things going on at once in this world, man. Yeah. Or, but um, number ten question. It's a good question for you. Um, 